Welcome to Chapel Online. Okay, so I know that you guys are excited. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna say Halle, you say Luya. Halle, Halle. I say A, you say Man. A, A. Awesome guys. Now what I want everybody to do is standing up, standing up on your feet, standing up on your feet. Okay. Now, like I told you guys before, we are going to. Walk around for 20 seconds and we're going to do a air high five because we are all excited to say hi to one another. Okay, so walk around and air high five somebody, okay? I'll give you guys about 20 seconds, okay? Ready and go. Woo, you know, say hi and wave, wave a bit, you know, it's fantastic. Awesome seeing everybody, okay? Now, all right, so we've got five seconds and five, four, Three, two, one. All right, everybody stretching up, stretching up. Okay, touch the sky, touch the sky. Okay, now reach down, touch your toes. Touch your toes, everybody. All right, stretch to the right. Yeah, and stretch to the left. Oh, okay. Everybody sitting down, sitting down, sitting down. All right, now I want each and every one of you to turn to the person next to you and go, shh, shh. Because right now, I've got someone who's been waiting, waiting to see you. So excited to see you, okay? All right, so guys, everybody count down with me. Three, two, one. Whoop! Shazam! Oh! 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 Hey, everybody! So awesome to see you guys. Okay, as you know, we've got some announcements to make. First of all, First of all, is we have chapel every Friday. Second of all, is make sure you guys get ready for our 60 second challenge. And what you need is a shoe. You just need one shoe. So everybody take off one shoe, okay? Oh man, it kind of smells a bit funny in here. <laughs> just kidding, okay. So make sure you have your one shoe ready for our 60 second challenge. Okay, and now it's time for our keyword. So make sure you guys know what keyword we are doing. Okay, and finally is our Bible verse. So remember, we've been looking at God is king, God is good, and God is love. And now we're looking at God is powerful. And our Bible verse is 2 Timothy 1 verse 7. For God did not give us a spirit of fear, but of power, love, and self-control. All right, that was our Bible verse for this month. And this is going to be our last story of looking at God is powerful. Powerful! Turn to the person next to you and go, Ah, oh, God is powerful! God is powerful! Alright! Now it's time for our song. So, stand it up everybody! Stand it up! Alright! Get ready to sing some songs. Sing, sing some songs. Sing some songs. Sing! Okay, here we go. There's power, there's power. There's wonder working power.
your voices. Okay, right now, it's time for our 60 second challenge. I hope you have a shoe. You have a shoe. You have a shoe. Ah, shoe. Oh, Shazam, man. Oh, my Shazam's been off today. All right, so it's time for our 60 second challenge. Okay, and I hope you all have one shoe. If you don't have one shoe, then you need to talk to your parents, okay? All right, but we got one shoe and here is the challenge, okay? Check this out. You need to place one shoe on top of your foot, okay? Make sure your leg is straight and then you have to try and kind of roll over on your stomach, keeping your shoe on top of your foot, okay, without dropping it, all right, turn over onto your stomach, okay, and then you have to turn on your back, still with the shoe on your foot, okay, now you're not allowed to sit up, you're not allowed to hold the shoe or anything like that, okay, so 60 seconds to beat Pastor J, okay, ready, three, two, one, and go. Stop, sitting down, sitting down, sitting down. Okay, shh. All right, how did you guys go? Did you get it? Do you guys want another go? Another 60 seconds? Okay, you guys got another 60 seconds to try it again, okay? And check out how Pastor J did it. How Pastor J did all these mistakes. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, and go. Okay guys, time's up, stop, 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 stop. All right, everybody, put your shoe down. Shh, quiet, quiet, quiet. Put your shoe down. All right, now everybody, have a look at the story of Jesus and seeing how Jesus has awesome power over death. This is the story of how Jesus died and he rose again. The soldiers took charge of Jesus. They made him carry a big wooden cross and they took him to a place called the Skull, Golgotha. There they nailed Jesus to the cross. And Jesus, Jesus died on the cross that day. 
Everyone who loved Jesus was very sad, but they forgot something important. Jesus had said he would see them again soon. After Jesus died, some of his friends laid his body in a big tomb and they sealed it shut with a large round stone. There were fierce soldiers guarding the tomb. Three days later, the earth started to shake. And then an angel of the Lord came down from heaven and he pushed the stone away from the tomb. And Jesus was risen back to life. This shows that not even death can defeat Jesus. Wow! What a story! Brand new life. Jesus raising from the dead hey it's kind of like new shoes now check out all these kind of shoes you got basketball shoes you got motorbike shoes you got school shoes ballet shoes rugby shoes any kind of shoes and you need these shoes to do all your activities but you get the shoes when they're brand new but what happens when you start using it they get dirty they get old they get broken you know sometimes you got shoes that talk like this all right then you have to buy new shoes and then they get old dirty and you gotta buy new shoes that's just like the story of jesus you know where for us it's kind of like our lives we always are making mistakes and we try and behave, we try and do our best, but we make mistakes again, and we make mistakes again, and we make mistakes again. But Jesus says when we believe in him, we will have everlasting life. And so when Jesus comes back from heaven, he's going to come and he's going to take us all to heaven and we will no longer make any more mistakes. Just like new shoes, it's like we'll get brand new shoes and they will never, ever get dirty again. And we get to live happily with Jesus forever and ever and ever and ever. God has the power over death. God has the power over death. Okay, so remember that. All right, let's pray. Father, thank you so much that you have the power over death. And that Jesus is going to come back and take us all to heaven so that and we don't need to live in a world of mistakes and we're just gonna have brand new lives brand new shoes forever and ever and ever in Jesus name amen all right guys that's a wrap hope you guys tune in next week next week we're gonna do some awesome stuff for chapel okay so remember Friday 2 p.m. okay but before we go We've got a keyword for you. Okay, now did anyone pick up our keyword? Our keyword is powerful. All right, powerful is our keyword. If you guessed that, well done. Okay, see you all next week.